Good afternoon, this is Patricia. I'm here today to show you the most beautiful paper I have worked with. It's a digital set by Kelly's Creations by Kelly on Etsy, and it is absolutely stunning. These are some of the papers I didn't use. I just thought I'd show you these. And again, it's Kelly's Creations by Kelly. Beautiful set. So let's begin our showing of my album I made with it. I have posted the front cover before, so you may have seen that. But it was so much fun to work with. So much fun. Um, I like to do like individual, like different pockets. Which, if you're not familiar with them, go on to YouTube and put junk journal pockets. There's plenty of ideas of what you can do. I love this. Look at those little girls. It actually could be me and my cousin Christine. We were both we're both similar ages. The cover I've done, it is material, um, that was a gift from someone who lives close to me. The lace I get from everywhere, everywhere that I can see lace I buy it. <laughs> so, so that's the first page. Um, as I said, you really, really don't need to do too much with this paper because every single page is just adorable. That's just a paper page, that's one of the pages. I did use um, tea dyed paper, um, and so I, I kind of printed over that, so it may be a little duller than it actually would be if you printed it on white. Um, this is just a regular belly band, a couple of um, tags in there, one don't want to come out. All right, come on now, don't fight, don't fight, uh oh, I'll sort that one out later. <laughs> He's giving me a hard time. Again, look at this paper. That's just paper. Yeah, another belly band with a few more tags. It, this tag is completely just paper. I did put a little charm on there, but look how cute that is. She is her, her digitals are just absolutely amazing. And this is uh, just a page that I've done nothing with. The paper may have ink from another project, but I never throw anything away, as you probably know if you've watched my other albums. This is a double tag page, which I like to do. And the tags are cost are just paper. I didn't, I didn't, other than putting the holder on, there's nothing else that I produced from that. It's all just Kelly's creations. I did sew around these. Many of them I don't. Okay, now you're going to find me to go back in. Alright, look at that. I think even the tea dye, I, I don't recollect doing that. But it has been a while since I started this. Just, I got sick in between all this, but of course I'm back to normal now. Thank goodness. Um, these are just little envelopes that come with the pack. I don't think I put anything in that one. No, didn't. And this is just like a little paper. Again, it comes with a pack. Look at that. Just beautiful. Just beautiful. And you've got plenty of flower pages. That's a pretty flower. Like a little pink bluebell. <laughs> Another flower page. Okay, that's a belly band. I did go a little extravagant with that one. There's lace and roses on it. Um, that's one of the flower papers. Um, okay, that's one I made prior to starting this book that I thought would fit in there. And the person there, the doll or whatever they're called, um, are Tim Holtz. The lace again. Don't ever throw anything away because you can make clusters with just about every little piece of thing that you think you, you'll never use. You can use for clusters. It's amazing what little of things you need to do those. That's a, a pocket that comes with just tags in it. 
again. I hope I'm not going too fast for you here. Just love it. Okay, I got fussy on this page. This is a cluster again. It's on um, a piece of probably some old cardstock that I wouldn't have used for anything else. And you just add what bits you find around on your desk usually. That's part of the kit. Okay, this is um, this is quite a a big uh, envelope page with pockets. You've got pockets up there, you've got pockets down here, and you've got pockets there. Again, this tag I made prior to starting this album, and this is a Tim Holtz um, doll. Bits of lace down there. And, I mean, you can put exactly what you want in there. You don't have to put tags in. But um, it works great. This is um, this whole thing is a used envelope. And you flip it out. And you can put things inside. Um, I have another tag in there. That's the front that you probably saw. My actual front is different, but once you put... Once you put stuff in, obviously you see you see what you're putting in. So just a little flower. And this look at that. This page is a knockout. Another little cluster and a tag made from the paper that comes. Nothing else, just the paper. Uh oh. Uh oh. Problems girls. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, do you all go through this or is it just me? <laughs> okay, another little belly band um, with various tags. One with a, a, well it's a bird tag so I put a bird charm on it. And one of the little girls that come with the kit. Alright, go back in, don't fight me. <laughs> it's Monday guys, it's Monday, come on. <laughs> Yeah, what do we have here? Oh, I love this one. This was a card that someone sent me that I probably wouldn't have used for anything else. But, of course, once you start layering up, it becomes magic and it's different. Um, I think this goes, ribbon goes really pretty with the paper. Just a piece I had lying around. And here we have a different tag. Which, um, that's a... Uh, I don't know where this was from. Helsinki? It must have been on stamps that some, my cousin sent me or my niece sent me from England. That tucks in. Another little ticket tucks in. It's rather a cute tuck spot. Well, I'll say that fast. <laughs> and here's another one with. Um, this is the paper from the set. I just back them with any piece of anything I have. I just stamped. If there's any stamps in this, it's probably a Tim Holtz set. Oh, come on. Don't be sticking on me. Okay. Oh, I love these birds. This is a double envelope set. We put bigger things in there and smaller things in there. That comes with the set. Look at this page. I absolutely love it. That's the page. I didn't add anything to that. As I said, you can, you, you absolutely do not need to do anything except make the album. Now this one I got rather carried away with. It's, um, I did find this and I'm going to kill myself because I can't remember who it was, um, on YouTube. And she gives you full instructions of how to make this. And actually it should go somewhere. And I got this right way around. Uh, yeah. So it's a dub double envelope set. It's all got pockets inside it. So the front one has a top pocket. This one, oh, is part of that pocket. This one has a pocket. This side has a pocket. There you go. I knew a side did at some point. And they're, they're just, you know, cute little tags. And there's plenty of journaling on the back. That one is just a piece of paper that was left that I covered. And they go in the side. It was meant to go like this when I originally started making this. But found that my album was too chunky, as I usually do. 
And, of course, I had to do it like this. But that's okay. It kind of looks cute. And this is the back page. And I haven't done anything with the back page. As I said, it's material. Um, I hope you take a, a minute to look at this. I absolutely love this set. Please go check out Kelly's Creations by Kelly. And thank you for looking. Hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.